Carol here with the Fresh Chili Company and I am making a glaze for a spiral bone-in ham and um, this is a very simple glaze. It calls for a stick of butter, a jar of our fresh red, any heat level that you'd like to use. I prefer the milder sauces because I am using our hot honey with it as well. So it's a jar of each and a stick of butter. That's all it is. And it is really a good glaze. So we start with the stick of butter. And we're just gonna put that in the pan and get that melting. drawer. You look at that color, look how rich and beautiful that is. I love working with fresh chili products because they they add so much to your recipes. They just make everything not only taste so good, but they they make your dishes so beautiful and um, just add so much to everything you make. So I like to get everything I can out of that chalk. Now comes the fun part, trying to get all this Yummy, gooey. Look how thick and gooey that honey is. And look at the rich color of this. Oh, my goodness. Look at this. Oh, oh look at that. This is going to be... This is going to be so good going all over my ham. Going all down in all the different spirals of my ham and then just cooking in there. Let me tell you. My relatives are going to love this. It's just such a beautiful, rich color, and yet the butter hasn't completely melted yet, so I can't pour it, can't pour it over my ham yet. But um, I'm excited to do so. It's going to be yum. Scorch. See, that butter is about gone. So I turn my fire off. I don't want it to scorch. My butter is down to like a pencil lead in here. So when you're cooking a spiral ham, um, you want to put it in the oven at about 275 to 300 and bring the internal temperature of the ham uh, up to 120, uh, 115 and then take it out and I'm about to do that right now so I've uh, had this in here for a while the bigger the ham the longer it's going to take I think it's about 12 minutes per pound is what it takes at about 300 to 325 degrees so uh, let me grab my uh, thermometer here and uh, check and see where we're at so you want to get this up to about 120 and um, because when you're finished you want it to be at about 140 and no more than 140. So uh, take it out at about 120 and I'm going to get out of the way here so you can see and then Carol is going to just pour this sauce that she's made. Drizzle that all down in those layers. Try to get it in between. Oh, just put it all down in these layers here. Mm -hmm. I think we have some puppy dogs in the back room holding out here. They want to come in and be with us <laughs> so bad. But Look at that beautiful color. 
It looks like cinnamon almost, the color. It's yeah. just a color of cinnamon. But it does not taste like cinnamon. Mm -hmm. Let me tell you, it has got. It is going to be so good. Oh, man. And I just cooked this with the juice from the ham. Uh, you could add some, maybe some Sprite or some orange juice, but uh, I just used the ham, ham juice. This was a sugar cured spiral ham, brown sugar cured spiral ham. Look at that beautiful. Yeah, we just wanted the flavor to come strictly from this chili glaze. Yeah, get some right on that side too. And then we're gonna put this back in the oven at about 350. And uh, we're gonna let this glaze cook into the ham. Oh my and, gosh. Uh, this is so pretty. What, is, how's it doing on the back? Probably a little more back here. Right in here. Yeah, cool. We're good. That is good. Oh, look at that piece. That's just falling off. You better there. grab that. And I better grab this. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> this is how we roll. <laughs> it's going to be okay. You know you're going to get that on your shirt. All over my face. Oh, oh man. man. Hey. That is phenomenal. Yeah, it's all over my face. <laughs> What do you think, Jenna? You want to taste it? Come here. Oh man. Ooh, and it's not too hot. No. It's uh, it's not, it's not hot, baby. It's got a little bit of a. It's I mean, it's chilly, but it's not it's, hot. There you go, babe. The sauce is just. Um, but it's sweet. The honey is so good. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> you like that? It's really good. It's really good. <laughs> Look how beautiful. It makes such a gorgeous ham. And that will that will go on there and now that the the honey in there will start to caramelize and will just be phenomenal. I'm gonna leave a little in the saucepan. I'll finish it up and take it out. And um, all I can tell you is oh. I wish you were here for dinner. Yeah. Because tonight we're going to have a pre-Thanksgiving meal. <laughs> it's so pretty. Look at that. Wow. That is almost as pretty as you are, baby. Look at that. We're going back in the oven at uh, 350 uh -huh. until that gets to uh, about 135 which isn't gonna take very long. And then we're gonna take it out and that honey and that chili is gonna have caramelized. Oh. My recipes are, are- Did you use fresh red or sun-dried? I use the fresh red. Fresh red, perfect. My, my recipes yeah. usually have three to four ingredients and that's it. Because I like to cook things simply, but yet deliciously. So Ooh, that is good. this and, this <laughs> and butter, this is all we had. The hot honey and a medium fresh red and ham. <laughs> and that's all you need. And you're gonna have a ham that people are gonna talk about every year. Happy Thanksgiving and eat more chili.